friends, I am at the Magic Kingdom today. It has been an Epcot filled week for me. So I actually decided that I need a little Magic Kingdom day. I'm with some friends that are actually visiting from Pennsylvania, first time that they're here. And I haven't been able to spend a lot of time with them because of everything going on. So I'm gonna spend a little time at Magic Kingdom and have a Magic Kingdom fun day. Let's go do this. First things first though, I wanna check to see if Mickey is back in his awesome outfit. And here he is, he's back. Mickey is back. And out of any time I've ever come to see Mickey, I've never walked in here. There's always a wait and they, we literally walked in. Oh, it's time. There he is. All the way up in Everyone, welcome as you're coming out. Now is a great time to open up those autograph books Second and make sure standard, that you have a magic band or a park ticket ready, ready so that we can scan for those photos. Thank you. Look at that. Great photographer. Candy corn, make me hungry. Thank you. <laughs> you guys can come out over oh, here. Right. Nice party, Max. Happy birthday. <laughs> Hiya, pal. Oh, there you go. <laughs> to you. <laughs> Bye, pal. <laughs> How awesome was that? I'm so happy he's back in his little magician outfit. And I'm also happy that the photo pass photographers are in there and I didn't see the box at all. So that means the box is gone. Maybe that petition that's been going on actually worked. Who knows? Crowds seem like very nice today. Honestly, it doesn't look that busy. First time visitors, definitely castle pictures. It's like, it's a have to. It's a have to. <laughs> I absolutely love it when people from Pennsylvania come visit me down in Florida. I get to hang out and pal around and be like a tour guide in the parks. I'm sure that I get annoying. <laughs> you know how Disney people get or how anybody gets. I'm like, oh, you know something about this and this. I try not to interfere much, but like, ah, sometimes you just want to be like, oh, don't, don't do that. Do that. But you got to let them enjoy and plan their vacation the way they want. I think a good introduction to Magic Kingdom probably would be Ride Space Mountain. So we're gonna scoot over to Tomorrowland and actually this is my first time seeing the new Tomorrowland sign. I know it's been here for a while. The other day when I came to Magic Kingdom, I only stayed actually out front near the train station because it was just to meet Mickey and hang out and have a beer at Tony's. So my first time seeing it. I don't know, I think it's wonderful. I don't know why anybody would be upset. I mean, it fits in good theming and everything like that. Tomorrowland. The last time I rode Space Mountain, it was in the complete darkness for Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. So it'd be good to hear the cool soundtrack and the You know that sound where you're going spinning around and around and around? Yeah, it always gets me. Starport 7-5. So it's been many years that I've been riding Space Mountain, but I finally figured out Mr. Johnson in the control tower. Holy moly. They can have the front. I like my little three. I like being in the back. I feel safe. I feel secure. It's wonderful. There she is. I wonder what those buttons do. Oh boy. almost got the lights turned on. We were stuck for about two to three minutes and I'm just praying. I'm like, turn them on, turn them on, but it didn't happen. So close. You know, I always want to ride that with the lights on. I did get uh, an evac one time, 
but it was at the very end and they just turned the lights on as we we're pulling into the station so I didn't see anything it almost happened there but man what I would give a lights on ride it's gonna happen one day watch I love these lights though I would love to have the lights in my living room along with the ball pit <laughs> We're gonna jump from Tomorrowland over to Adventureland to get on Pirates of the Caribbean. I think that that's a next very good move. You know, I don't wanna just be like, hey, you guys wanna go to Country Bears? Greatest ride in the world. Forgot about the parade. So we're gonna have to really journey to get over to Adventureland. Come on, Hook. I saw you yesterday. You were in the parking lot. It's really hard because to get over to Adventureland, we have to go like this way and we can't cross the street. Well, they'll give you mid breaks, but wait a second. Is it gonna happen? There it is. Thank you. But back to what I said. So we're actually gonna have to go up and go into the castle and then walk down. Nope, that's still not gonna work because then we're gonna get by the Haunted Mansion. Maybe the parade by end. Maybe we should just wait. Another really cool thing is, I don't know if a lot of you know, but they actually widened this walkway here. They took that bench out, I see, as well. But it's really coming in handy because it used to be where you can only fit like three people side by side. But look at all this. Wow. That is something that really needed to be done. Just a short detour and look at that. Adventureland. I love it. Wow, and it's very congested over here. I'm kind of shocked. Well, actually not really because it's always congested in Adventureland. I think it's the narrow walkways. Yo ho, yo ho, a pirate's life for me. Yes. Oh, not you? Oh. I just love the smell of pirates. And I love to see what these guys are up to. Just dying. There it is. Be ye warned, be matings. A perilous fate lay on the horizon. If anybody wants to know who my favorite person is in Pirates of the Caribbean, it's the guy that's getting drunk with his cats and it's like, here kitty, kitty, kitty. I love it. I laugh just like watching them. We really want to get Splash Mountain done, but it seems like it's a very popular ride today because it's a little bit hot. So we haven't been able to get a fast pass for that yet, but we did get Big Thunder Mountain. I don't think they're ready. You guys ready? I don't think you're ready. For the wildest ride in the wilderness! This is like the hottest spot in Disney World. When you're stuck in this corridor, it gets so hot and sweaty and you lose cell service. It's very bad. So if you ever do get stuck here, just pray. All right, good, good, good. We're just getting right through there. I love it. Oh 
Oh shoot. <laughs> Gotta hit this little guy off. I'm bald. <laughs> oh boy. Thunder always does the trick. Shakes you up a little bit, gets you all worked up and ready to go so you can eat tacos. So I have to say, I never had Pecos Bills before, but look at that taco trio. Wow. It's not mine, it's Amber's, but still, if I was eating right now, I probably would get this. Impressed. Oh my God, it's a Disney cat right here at Pecos Bill. Oh, I'm so excited to see this happening. Come here, little fella. I know, right? I'm a Disney cat. There he is. Ah. So exciting just to see one of the Disney cats out and about running. I get, I, I want to chase it, but it's not nice. It doesn't want to be around humans. I think it's more scared. So he ran back over to Splash Mountain and he's gonna hang out over there probably. So we're having a great day at the park, but I think it's time that we call a day. They're gonna go back to the room and rest a little bit. We got a lot accomplished. We did Space Mountain, Pirates of the Caribbean, Big Thunder Mountain in like an hour and a half. Plus we just experienced Main Street USA. Oh, we also met Mickey and did a couple photos and that's not a bad, bad time. So love the life you live. We'll see you next time. Bye. Goodbye, friends. I won't be lonely, but you can come back anytime. They didn't even hear me. <laughs>